It's recording. All right. Hi, my name is Joy the Greatness, and I'm going to tell you what are my favorite books I use for art. All right. So, oh, this one is about symbols. Like, you know, anybody who want to look up history of symbols, you can't just use it. You can make up a symbol, but you have to understand what the symbol means before you are putting it on there. This one's a good one. This one has every symbol and every ancient time. They call it signs and symbols. This one's a good one. I got this at Amazon. So I think everyone should get this. Artists are not an artist. This is really a good book. Encyclopedia book about uh, artists, African American artists, but I only got one artist. You know, every artist in the book, uh, this one, is sculpture, painters. I really like this one because it has like people who did films, you know, documentaries, painting, acrylic, folk art. Every inch, like full teams, everyone. It's really a good book. And I got this one at Amazon too. It's really good. Book. Know your people, African Americans. And this one, this book is art therapy, you know, know your craft, know the way you paint, you know, describe it, it, it teaches you more about, about how you express yourself in the uh, uh, art therapy. It, it's really a good book, and I got this at Amazon, too. So, I, I read it, like, all the time, try to, you know, it motivates you to do this, you know, it, it really motivates you. But, but this one is, like, personal, you know, like, world, all that stuff is, like, you know, in some of my artwork, like, you have, like, world and it teaches a lot of things. That's the cold, you know, gives you like a lot of ideas for what to do in your art. Shape. Really my favorite part. Really. And I got this one at I guess it's at half price bookstores. It's really cheaper to get it at half price bookstores. All books are cheaper at half price bookstores. Uh, this one, I looked at the store at half price bookstore. It has like 500 self portraits of the painters. It's just, it's just so much. Thank you. In here, it's just like every painter of themselves are in here. Not every painter, but any painter that did a self portrait of themselves. This is like my favorite book, and it shows like all the painters that paint. This one is a good book for the arts to draw people. This is, this is like a really good book for people who want to like draw people or sketch, or, you know, sketch people. This is really good for people who want to learn how to sketch. It was a needle in a haystack to find this sort of book. Like, I finally found a good book. And it shows like a, you know, replicas, like sketching and space. 
face and body, everything. Like feet, legs, hands, and all of it. You know, legs, body, face. Yeah. I love it. I really love this one. And this one is art and fear. I think one guy, he is too shot. I didn't know the book, but I know the book. It's about, it's the same thing as art and therapy. He's like, well, the first one tells you more details, but this one tells you, like, what is your fears, and, you know, just, it's more positive of your own artwork. So, I like this one, and I like this one. So, it's like, both of these are my favorite ones. This is the mother's load of sketching. This has everything. Sketching of landscape, space. It, it's got items. It has animals and everything in here. I finally found a book. And I got this on Amazon. I got this. And have our too. So, this one is very good. Like, it just has everything. It, it has everything in the book. It's got hands, it's got legs, you know, it's got like items, landscapes, all that. This is a really good book. This is like the mother love Bible. <laughs> but this one, I guess this is a high person. World of art, people who did art all over the world. So it's like the greatest art I ever seen in my life. It's so great. I have another book that I don't have, but it's the same thing, but this one is like a Wikipedia. Where I got this for a half high school for that. But it's been here and I was like, great, dude. It makes you understand what kind of artwork they use, what pieces, what history, history of art. And it shows you what kind of kinds of art you can do. You can do acrylic, you can do uh, oil paint. It is really showing you. And I have another book similar like this, but it shows the painting and they show how much the old paintings were. And they show you what year of the painting they were made and who, who did it. So, that's really it. It's called Witness of Art. I don't have the book with me, but it's just like this. It's like a, I see it, but I am so happy that I shared you with all my favorite books. I am so glad you know a little bit about me, and I am so glad.